Morning all. I'm heading out to do a couple of drone flights this morning. Uh, mostly motorway, so I'm not going to be doing much filming on this, but that's the way it is, unfortunately. To be honest with the rain, the way it's been the past few days, it's been pouring rain all week. I don't really fancy going in mud and leaf strewn back roads on the bike if I don't have to. So, as you can see, the roads are still wet and minging. But it's still nice being out in two wheels, regardless. So I'm going up to get the Kelpies this morning. And I would then like to move on to Stirling and get Wallace Monument in Stirling Castle. That's it. Nothing major, just a couple of wee flights. And I think that would be pretty good. At the Kelpies, I'll probably have to use the Mini Drone, the Mini 3 Pro. Mostly because there'll be people standing around it and close to it, so we'll see when I get there, I don't actually know. And the monuments, I should be able to use the Air 2S this morning. And uh, we'll see how it goes, hopefully the winds aren't blowing too strong because the Mini 3 is not the best in the strong winds. The Air 2S is not bad and the Mavic is like a tank. Anyway, I'll sign off for now because there's no point in sitting here in the motorway boring you. So, catch you in a bit. Hi again, that's me in the outskirts of Falkirk. I've had to put my sat nav in because I don't know how to get to the Kelpies, but according to this, it's four mile away, so not bad journey. Quick up the motorway, and uh, when did I leave? About quarter past eleven, so it's not half an hour, it's taking. I can live with that. Well, the next uh, footage you'll see is hopefully a drone video of the Kelpies. As long as there's not another drone pilot there. But hopefully not. Catch you soon. visit to the Kelpies and I was hoping that I could get the drone up but I can't it's the bottom line so I've got three places I want to film the Kelpies up here in Falkirk I want to film the Wallace Monument in Stirling Castle now I have to get permission from all three bodies to do filming and each of them require someone with a minimum of a CAA operational authorization which I have so I've sent emails off to all three people and I'm hoping uh, at some point, very soon, I will be able to get up here and get filming properly um, in a closed environment when there's no people there, which would be fantastic. But in the meantime, I've got some pictures. Nothing overly exciting, but a couple of iPhone shots. Uh, it was worth it as well to come up, to be honest, because there's power lines running right along the Kelpies here. And it's good to come up and get a risk assessment done so that at least I know when I do come up here exactly what I'm looking at rather than just looking at Google Maps satellite view. So happy days. Uh, and it was nice to go out on a sunny day on the bike for a couple of hours. But anyway, I'm off for just now and I'll speak to you in a bit. Bye bye. Uh, I don't know if I switched the camera on in time. But that's where I've just been. Absolutely love it. I'd like to come up here on a less blustery day with my wife and spend some time in the car, you know, which would be nice. But here we go, road works again. So, I'm sure you don't want to see me riding the motorway, so I'll see you in a bit. 
see you later. Bye. Well, I'm back home. Just about. Wasn't a very exciting journey. Bit of traffic in the M8 in the usual places because of roadworks, which I'm pissed off with. 